All right, the boards are back from PCB Way. Thanks to PCB Way for supplying boards. And we got a bunch of them. So uh, these are really fun. They have a big cutout in them. I, 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 I don't know if it really matters with an LM399, but it was fun to do, so I figured I'd do it. You see this often in the 1000 parts, the TL, what were they, LT1000s or whatever, the real expensive parts. But I thought I'd do it on this one just for, just for fun. Um, and uh, I'm using a big regulator here. I, a small regulator would be fine, but I don't have any small regulators, so I went ahead and laid it out for a big one. Uh, so yeah, you can nitpick this board. But uh, it is an LM399 and some associated circuitry, so you can amplify the 7 point whatever volts this thing is to, um, to 10 volts and uh, get 10 volts out of it. Uh, or is it three point? I don't remember the voltage of these things. Anyway, you multiply it up. I think it's three, three, point, three point something volts. Um, multiply it up and get 10 volts. So that's what this circuitry over here does. And there's an adjustment, 10 turn pot adjustment. So um, yeah, let's build one up. All right, so I'm gonna use a microscope um, and a syringe with the, uh, with the solder paste on it. And I just put little blobs of uh, little blobs of solder paste on there, and then with tweezers, I'm going to uh, put down the parts. So I'll figure out which ones I need, and we'll put them down. Uh, let's see here. Where is my tweezers? All right, here we go, I'll load it up. Uh, so we have the uh, 399 over there, the regulator. You don't have to solder it down or put a heat sink on it. It doesn't draw much current at all. It's just uh, what I had on hand. Uh, so yeah, there we go, and a yellow one, a yellow uh, 10K resistor there. So let's uh, hook it up and uh, see if we can't make it go. I need to find a uh, single op amp for it. All right, I put in 15 volts and uh, measuring the output. Uh, let's measure the output right there. And uh, let's adjust it. Yeah, let's adjust it. Um, if I can get my adjustment tool on the... There we go. That's going that away. Let's see if we can go... All right, this is going the wrong way, going the wrong way. Let's see if we can't uh, figure out what's going on here. Let's see, we want to be going, we want to be going this way, so there's a resistor value that we'll probably need to change. All right, let's see what, uh, what resistor we needed to change. All right, so let's disconnect these and we'll measure the uh, location of this, um, where the potentiometer is. It's, uh, it's this one here, if you can read that. So I have these two buffer resistors here and one of them's probably too big. It needs to go further in one direction or the other. So let's, uh, let's see if we can't figure that out. Uh, currently our potentiometer is not measuring. There we go. Um, that's measuring 1K. And this is measuring 7K, so it wants to go to this side. It wants to go to this side, and that's R7 side. So the R7 needs to, it's 10K right now. We'll need to lower it down to a smaller value. I'll put it in a 4.7. That should fix it up. All right, let's see if that helped. Uh, 15, let's see, this is my measurement. Up my measurement. I'll hook uh, 
15 volts back up. And yeah, there we go. So now we are very close. So let me adjust from here. And that's that way. Let's go this way. And there we go. Look at that. Not too bad. Not too bad. So I don't know how stable these uh, three nine nines are. I mean, this is a six and a half digits, so it's going up. Interesting. Not exactly sure what uh, what all what all needs to settle in. We just turned this thing on. We might need to let it sit for half an hour and then go back and adjust it. does seem to be moving. Let's see if we can't adjust it a little bit here. Oops. It does seem to be drifting in the positive direction, so I think we need to uh, let it warm up for a while. All right, it's been warming up for about 10 minutes now and it seems to be uh, seems to be fairly stable. Anyway, it's a fun little project. All right, I'll put the board up on my uh, share site and uh, link down below. Yeah, there you go. Turned out pretty good. I like it.